Wolves were here historically. Wolves evolved with the large ungulates that we have on this landscape. Wolves were eradicated and bringing wolves back was a good idea. My name is Doug Smith. I work for Yellowstone National Park as wolf project leader. So I manage and study wolves in Yellowstone National Park. My responsibility is the wolf program. Yellowstone was established in 1872 and wolves were here. Uh, they were doing well. Um, but at that time, there were good animals and bad animals, and wolves and other carnivores were very much considered bad. So it was our policy to eradicate all the predators, and there was a special interest in getting rid of all the wolves. So all of the wolves in Yellowstone were killed off by 1926. We didn't know their role, their function, their importance. It's not too strong to say that predation is one of the most potent and important forces in all of nature. And so I was hired to come in with an effort uh, to restore wolves to Yellowstone. Hearing a lot about next year is the wolf in the West. That's the reintroduction of wolves into Yellowstone National Park. It's hard to overstate how big reintroducing wolves was, but it took 20 years because of this history, this fabled history of controversy of some people like them, some people don't. Well, the biggest problem wolves have is everybody's got an opinion about them. And usually that opinion is based on misinformation. I mean, we're dealing with this uphill battle of Little Red Riding Hood, Three Little Pigs, Peter and the Wolf. You know, what I'm referring to is, is mythology, folklore. Separating the folklore, the misinformation of what wolves are really like, is an important step towards managing them in reality. <laughs> because we've been managing them in kind of mythology for a long time. Wolves do not belong in all places. But the places they do belong, we have to vigorously defend and protect. Wolves need the things that keep places like Montana, Idaho, and Wyoming great. Their power is something that grips us. You know, just for that reason alone, I don't think we should lose them. I think one of the best arguments to have wolves is ethical. Do we have the right to completely wipe out another species or relegate it to the ends of the earth? I just don't think that's right, and ultimately, I think that will be our demise if we do that. We are focused on using science to really influence our advocacy and policy. And really, the world is watching this experiment to ensure that we do it right. And that's what GYC is working on, is ensuring that the wolf recovery can be done correctly here in the greater Yellowstone.